Now for a story that is positively Wisconsin, our chance to show you how people in our community are making a positive impact. Like the young students in the Howard Swamico School District, Local 5's Katie Amrine shows us how some troops overseas will soon get a special delivery. We drilled hearts around it to show that we all love the, the soldiers. Students at Lineville Intermediate and Forest Glen Elementary are showing their appreciation for members of the U.S. military ahead of Veterans Day, like Evelyn Gosen, who was just one of 1,300 students participating in the project. We wrote, like, thank you to the soldiers and thank you for all that you did and, like, for putting your lives before ours. The letters will be put in care packages and sent to the 40th Infantry Division stationed in the Middle East. This started as just a way for me to teach my two children why they grew up the way they did in a military family and to help them understand the bigger picture. Catherine Sua with the Wisconsin National Guard says the letters will remind soldiers what they are fighting for. Even though we're not home, that our sacrifices that we make are definitely appreciated and it means a lot coming from the youth because they are the next generation that we're fighting for. A message that's not lost on the youngest minds but instead celebrated. It means to show them respect and uh, just bring them joy. Thank you for serving our country and we hope you can get back to your families in peace. In Howard, Katie Amrine, Local 5 News. The adopt a troop program is set to expand and become a nonprofit to help more members of the military community.